can see there from those pictures, it was a clear night, but it is chilly. Yes. Freeze warning as well in effect. Here's Lonnie. With yeah. The you, you, look, I had to go see some friends during my dinner break, and then I, I looked at my watch. I had to really hustle to get back here. So I was like riding my bike as fast as I could, and the air is so cold out there. You know when you suck in the cold air? <coughs> I mean, it's, uh, it just sort of burns your lungs. That's what you're dealing with outside right now. I'll show you. I mean, look at your temperature reading. I mean, there's your sky. It is clear like KJ refers to, but it's only 36 degrees. And the temperatures will continue to drop. You're going to go below the freezing mark in New York City, down to 30 degrees. Now, you do have a good looking sky overhead, but boy, it's cold out there. The winds are not crazy strong, but there's enough wind out there with an occasional maybe 15 mile per hour, maybe even a 20 mile per hour gust. That 30 degrees will feel like you're in the 20s if and when you catch that wind. By the afternoon, you rebound nicely to 55 degrees, mostly sunny, about 10 to 15 degrees warmer tomorrow than you were today. Now I say you rebound nicely because 55, just about where you should be this time of the year. The average is 56. I mean, today, the best you could do is 38. I mean, my goodness, you're, again, right about at the 56, at the 56 degree mark tomorrow. And then we'll get even warmer still by the time we get to Easter. Easter, we're talking about a partly to mostly sunny sky, about 62 degrees, so a few degrees above average. but. We're moving in the right direction, gang. All right, it's going to be a good spring weekend out there. The skies, they're going to cooperate. All right, you'll get your sunshine out there. I don't really see any big problems brewing. In fact, I don't see any big problems brewing for days and days on end. Now, the air is cold, but you're seeing a little bit of a speck of an upper level snowflake, maybe a little upper level raindrop there well off the Jersey Shore. It's not really making its way down to the surface. It's not affecting anybody. It's not part of my forecast, but it just shows you. The cold air is in place out there. Bigger picture is going to show you with a high pressure over West Virginia, it's cycling in that northwest wind, right? That's why you were so, that's the reason you were so cold today. That high pushes east tomorrow. Now we tap into the backside of the high. Same circulation, right? But now it's bringing in more of a southerly breeze. And you can see we had the, the blue coloring on the map, whereas tomorrow we'll get into this green, sort of greenish yellow color. So your temperatures are going to be more moderate, more in line with where you should be time of the year. So here's how I see everything across the board. Plan on a pretty good looking weekend. It's a cold start for Saturday. Sub freezing out there about 30 degrees. Feeling a bit cooler with the winds that are blowing. 55 on the thermometer. Easter Sunday as we said about 62. Now at one point in time we thought there might be a risk for some early morning rain. You know I've taken that cloud which you see right there and, and I've even taken the raindrops off. I think the raindrops are not going to be a player for us. They're up in northern New England, and I kept saying, well, maybe they could drift a little farther south. It looks less and less likely. I think Easter Sunday looks pretty good out there. A few more clouds, sure. And then you get to Monday, you're 63. Tuesday, 64. Wednesday, 66. But notice the pattern here. There's really no big system brewing. You will see a rain shower chance on Thursday and Friday, but boy, it's a slight chance. That's not much rain at all. All in all, I think I told you guys this earlier in, in the evening when we did the six o'clock news. This is a pretty good seven day forecast for this time of the year because the spring can be typically pretty volatile, and I don't see it right there for this seven days. So enjoy all that, and happy Easter, everybody out there who celebrates. God, it's all yours. You will take it, Lonnie, seven days. Thanks, Thanks. Lonnie. Thanks.